Making pasta is easy. Don't touch the flowers, please. You're going to break them. Couscous is a North African pasta dish that is granulated and steamed, and my mic fell. I'm gonna try and make radishes fun. Okay. <laughs> Hi, I'm Roni, and if I had all the time in the world, I would be in the kitchen because I love to cook. But I just don't have the time. I have a busy life. I work full time, I have a husband, I have a baby. So I've created some really easy ways to reinvent dinner. Is food and lifestyle expert Roni Proter is back here in the kitchen, and we're gonna cook up a little healthier take on pork tenderloin, something we can mm -hmm. do for a quick weeknight dinner, Roni. With Dinner Reinvented, everything is about what shortcuts can I take that will not compromise the food. And I did this with uh, tricolored carrots. We were talking before well, about right. tricolored carrots. Right, in the last time you told me all about tricolored yeah. carrots, which I didn't even know were a thing. So I put them as a bed, and then I just popped the uh, pork tenderloin on top and put it in the oven for about 35 to 40 minutes. And here's another great thing to make sure that you keep all of the moistness of the mm -hmm. meat is, um, you know, we're gonna have a little wine. Sure. I like to, I like to open up. Knows a how to do it. <laughs> I like to open up a bottle of wine. So I add a splash to the pan while I'm cooking it. So right. you get all of the white wine that you're going to be drinking already and you get it infused Ooh, yeah. into the pork and the carrots. It adds just that much more flavor. Nice. Okay, so that's dinner one night. Now let's yeah. reinvent it. Now let's reinvent it. So do you ever do a Cobb salad? I've done a Cobb salad in a million years. Well, maybe it's time. Maybe to, it is time. To go back to it. Instead of the deli turkey or roasted turkey, why not cube half of this pork tenderloin and put it on top of a bed of lettuce us. So now let's make some street tacos. Let's make some street tacos. We're going to open up our own food truck right here in the Better Show kitchen. <laughs> I love that. I used uh, mango salsa. So when you save time and use a pre-marinated pork tenderloin, you have a little extra time to do other prep work. So I made a mango salsa, and mangoes are uh, coming into season right now in South America. So mm. it's another great thing to pick up. It's going to be more affordable, less costly, and it adds a lot of vibrance. I like having a bar so that you can choose whatever you want. Again, kids who are picky can dress their tacos however words, they want. In other all kids. Well, not all kids, you but, cer a little, but certainly mine, yeah. Some pico. A little pico de gallo in there as well. And a little do you make cabbage. your own pico de gallo? I do. Okay. You want to take a bite? I'm I do, and I'm afraid I'm going to be a huge mess everywhere. Hang on. That's the point of mm -hmm. street tacos. They're messy, mm -hmm. they're delicious, mm. but it's light, really flavorful, isn't mm -hmm. it?